So can you see the wind blowing? Not really. What you're seeing is the reaction of the wind from the tree. Uh, the same thing happens with forces and loads that happen on building frames. When a, a force impact hits a frame, there's energy that goes into the frame and follows the frame down. Well, just to uh, reduce those forces and make the forces act a little bit smoother in the frame, we went with this continuous structural strapping component to see what would happen. And what we did was developed a, a force uh, energy absorbing uh, secondary subframe or, or a uh, continuous reinforcing. So when the frame is hit by the force, the force goes into the frame and goes up into this strapping uh, reinforcing connector and it goes into the strapping cords. So this energy goes around and it goes through these strapping cords. Now, because we put this rigid cap uh, connected directly through the strapping cord and then anchored into the frame, once the force enters, enters the strapping net system, steel strapping system, then the force will not re-enter back into the frame. And that was the hope and that was a, what, what our objective was. Well, we have solved that. And that is what we've uh, developed out of this. So we're going to show you this uh, through a lateral force. So we're going to use this this end of the no, I'm sorry, we're going to use this end of the frame as the impact side. And we're going to do it in a lateral drop so that the force is going to be actually hitting from here. So our objective is that the force will go up into these strapping cords throughout the whole net system. We'll show you one again that the strapping is continuous. That means we have a top and bottom set of rings with linking cords in between. The hope is that this strapping cord, which is the opposite side of where we're going to hit the as this strapping cord on the opposite side of where we're going to hit the force impact on the frame is the strapping cord that's going to end up vibrating. Why? Well, the main reason is we're going to hit in force impact on this corner here. That means the strap the loads are going to hit into this strapping cord this way and this way and this way and this way and end up at this bottom one. So it's going to end up coming in this direction and this direction. We're going to try that again. We're going to come into both directions. So this strapping cord should vibrate like that under this force impact. We're going to try this again. We'll see if it happens again. Okay, we're going to drop it this way. And we're going to watch just this strapping cord. Okay. And there you go. So we have a successful system here.